Mr. Spolowski here. Welcome to the STEM Lab, boys and girls. 2015-2016 school year. I'm excited to have you aboard. Guess what? This little spot right here, it says STEM. It says wait. When you come to the STEM Lab, this is where you wait. And when you're in the hallway, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be modeling what good students do. So I'm going to be good, Mr. Spolowski. If you see me put this awesome dinosaur hat, I'm bad, Mr. Spolowski. So I'll be either doing the right thing or the wrong thing. It'll be up to you to decide which one is right. So when you, when you enter, while you're waiting for me to pick you up outside the lab, you need to stand with your hands on your side, looking straight ahead. Team, okay? It's called the team line. That's what I'm looking for. But if I walk out and I see, you're like, ooh, look at me, Mr. Spouse. Hey, I'm over here. That's not what I want to see. Your teacher does not want to hear you talking either. This is the hallway. Let it be the hallway. So let's see how we walk into the room. I might even discuss the bad way. There's only one way, and that's the right way. Let's go. So as I'm walking, I'm not talking. Walking in straight. I'm greeting Mr. Slowski. How you doing, Mr. Slowski? I might shake his hand, give him a high five, give him a pound, whatever it is. As I, as I walk into the classroom, I walk straight in. I go to the first purple square if I'm the first person in the line. Now, I'm big. I'm old. I'm 32, and guess what? I can fit in one of these squares. Crisscross, applesauce, just like that. I did not want to see it. Get out of my way! I like blue and purple! If that happens, you'll be put in the pouty corner. The pouty corner, that's right. I'm going to have a tantrum corner this year. If you go there, no STEM challenges for you. You will not like that. So, why, why I'm sitting at the carpet? Mr. Spolsky's teaching, I'm going to be respectful. Our rule number one, respect. I'm going to make sure I'm looking at him, I'm listening to him at all times. I'm not going to be playing with my friends. I'm not going to try to poke Mr. Spolsky. I'm going to sit here, smile, and look. So, now we know about the carpet. We're going to talk about getting up from the carpet. Well, when I get up from the carpet, if Mr. Spolsky says, Purple Row, go to table one, this is table one right here. And know what this next table is? This is table number, that's right, you guessed it, two. After two comes what? Three, yes. This is table four. And you would have guessed it, but this one is five. And this one would go six. Six, that's right for you Spanish speakers out there. I know a little bit, not very much. Now let's say you're at, you're at your table and you're doing a STEM challenge. You've got your activity out. You and your friend, so my friend's sitting right here, you're like, we need to work together on this. All of a sudden, you grab a hexagon, and then the other friend sitting here and says, that's my hexagon, give it to me. I don't want to share with you. You're the one to share with me. Why won't you share with me? And then Good Sean says, wow, holy moly, take a breather. We need to work together. We need to work respectfully. Respect, that is our number one rule in this class. Again, we respect our friends, we respect our teammates, we respect anybody, whether they're boy or girl, adult, young or old, and we make sure we respect. And guess what? If there's an announcement, we stop and we listen to that announcement. It sounds like Miss Davis is needed in the office, and that's great. We want to make sure we're always listening, and first and foremost, we always make sure we have fun. Now, I hope we have a lot of fun this year. I hope you're always on your best behavior. I hope. I don't see any bad Mr. Splowskis, because that's not what I'm looking for in here. I'm looking for respectful students who care, who want to have fun, who I want to find out this year what your hopes and dreams are. I want to see determination. I want to see you never give up. I want to make sure that every time you're here, you live with a smile on your face and you have a positive attitude. Let's have a great year. See you soon.